I'm Ryan Kleckner. I'm a former special operations sniper. I'm the best-selling author of the Long Range Shooting Handbook. And I want to talk to you a little bit about shooting a precision rifle with a pistol grip on it. So whether you're shooting an AR-10 like this new Barrett Rec-10 or some of the more popular chassis systems that you'll see on bolt-action rifles, this pistol grip can actually be a hindrance if you're not careful. See, the idea of these pistol grips is a way to control a firearm better. Like on AR-style rifles, it allows you to get better control of the gun. But if you're shooting a precision rifle, that can be a bad thing. You see, most precision rifles are going to shoot better without you. The more control you impart on the gun, the less accurate it's actually going to be. So by using this to aid in controlling the gun, it can hurt. A way to mitigate that is stop using the pistol grip like a standard pistol grip when you're in a position like this and you don't need to hold the gun. When the rifle's rested like this, in order to get rid of that chance for me to impart too much control, all you do is you bring your thumb over to the other side. It gives you more of a traditional rifle style stock and still allows you to pull the rifle to the rear to hold onto it securely without torquing it too much. Let me show you what this looks like. So it's still easy to shoot the rifle, you're not losing that much control and it can really help with your accuracy. Something else to consider is if you notice, I use the safety on the right side of this gun. Thankfully, this one ships with an ambidextrous safety on it. You may have to install one on yours, or if you have some of the more modular ones where they can have an option to attach the safety lever on this side, you might want to do a little trick, which is to put the safety lever on the opposite orientation when it's on the right side. That way, when the gun goes into the fire mode, the tab sticks up and it doesn't get in the way of your knuckle on the shooting hand. Well, another benefit to this gun is if you notice, it's not a full 90 degree safety. So it allows me to put the gun on fire without it interrupting with my knuckle. And I can even, when I'm done shooting, take it off safe with my thumb. Next time you shoot a gun with a pistol grip, try this. I bet your groups might get better.